Jin Young Ko began the day five shots in the rears of Megan Kang, but she's got a history of Sunday comeback. This putt will be quick down the hill. First, we go to the ninth. Yep, second shot for Jin Young Ko. shot there we watched so many players this morning so hard to get it close to that hole well played there of course she did she's within one nice putt there at the ninth solid two under par gets her to minus eight she has 163 to the front it's playing about five yards downhill so my guess is she's trying to carry that front number and let it release and this is headed right All right, third shot up ahead for Jin Young-Ko. This ball's kind of sitting up on top of the rough. I would imagine she would play this back in her stance, kind of like a bump and run. The par five, the 11th tee, Jin Young-Ko. She just looks really solid, Jim. Yeah, she's Perfect. solid on the range. She didn't miss it very often. That'll be good right there. Decision whether she goes forward or lays up. Yes, this is her five hybrid. Ball's slightly above her feet. Well, this ball looks like it's going left. And it is. There's a penalty area. Kicked down, but it stayed in the penalty yeah. area. That's about 50 yards to the whole location. If that releases. It's not going to get up the slope, but she'll have that left for par. Yeah, that's an interesting thing to say, Ange, because it's not like it's a very strenuous walk. It's not exceptionally warm. And she certainly knows how to conserve her energy properly. She's done this plenty of times in the past. So I was a bit surprised to hear her talk about struggling to keep her energy levels up yesterday. This is a seven iron. This whole location is only five paces on. Just a little bit of a bowl. She's not going to need to worry about that at all. Beautiful shot. She has to be thinking that Megan and Sayang are going to birdie that par five. Ah, she knew it right away, went left immediately. She's not only got with the uh, Korean contingent cheering her on. All right, back in the fairway at the 13th, Jin Young Ko's second shot. The location on the back right portion of the screen, the back part of the green goes away. Big kick as it has done. Trying to feed back there, nicely done. She'll have that for birdie. I don't think either one of us could enjoy it. Yeah. Back to you, Grant. She's my new favorite follower, Jim. Everybody follows you, Grant. All right, Jin Young Ko is following. She's trying to make a birdie. And she leaves it short again. Wow. Just a quick thought about Andrea Lee. She didn't even have her tour card when last season started. And this qualifying period that ends today began in September of 2021. Penalty on herself to drop out of the top mm. 10 going into the day is right on the doorstep of getting in next week. Meanwhile, at the 14th, Jin Young Ko suddenly... After being tied for the lead, is three back. Megan, of course, with those two birdies. And um, Angela Stafford has hustled back to catch up with Jin Young Ko again. Second shot at 14. She has 125 here. This is a wedge. And a really, really good one. It's a big one. And a really confident stroke. There was. All right, back at the 15th tee, the par five. Jin Young Ko has parted this hole every day. Needs a birdie. Yeah, she backed off and she was talking to her caddy. Went out to the right. 
third shot from Jin Young Ko here at the par five. 80 yards. She hates it, looks like. She should. Ugh. That's not what she wanted. Well, you can see the ball. The lie is decent, but it's all downhill to the hole. All right, chip it in. Mm, great shot there. Well, this was just a moment ago. Jin Young Ko hit that wonderful chip shot. This to save her par to stay at minus eight. And she does. Nice aggressive stroke there. So one back. On the tee at 16, Jin Young Ko. I think she's got to get this one on the fairway. Kind of a big miss back there, not getting that birdie on 15. Missing that green. And she's going to just miss the fairway here. At the 16th, Jin Young Ko, one back. This is 129 to the whole location, but she really just needs to fly it 10 on and let it release all the way back there. Exactly what she did right there. Oh, what a shot at this moment to put some pressure on Megan. It's got to be inside the whole left edge. In there, like swimwear. <laughs> Jin Young Ko, former number one in the world, is tied for number one on the leaderboard with Megan Kang. Playing 152 today. It's only eight on. This is an eight iron. The only way you're going to keep it on the green, she does that. That's the 20th player to hit this green regulation. Yeah, the only way she held that, she hit just short and it kicked on and in and actually spin. That's the only way you can hold this green. That's for birdie. Did she? Right at the end. Dave Brooker was shocked. He thought she made it as well, or Caddy. Everybody, I think, did. Well, she herself. Might have deserved that one after hitting yeah. the hole yesterday and yeah, that's true. bouncing to the back of the green. You know, and another one of these dead straight holes that Shaughnessy has so many of. Jin Young Ko. Uh oh. A little blood coming right out of the shot. right there to be on the correct side of that tree have a shot now she's chipping back up the hill She looks just like she did when she won here in 2019. Just so clutch. Jim Yanko post nine under and puts the pressure on Megan Kane. Bit of an overcorrection oh, no. here. Way left. There is a low punch under this tree. Well, a great effort, but it's going to leave Megan Kang with three putts to win for the first time. And the 2019 CPKC women's.